to the cage, 10 and three out of Coconut Creek, Florida, from American Top Team. Coming off a win last year against Chino Duran. As a Titan FC veteran, having fought for Titan FC several times, look at his way, look at him make his way right back up there into the big show, and using Keith the Rockstar Richardson as a stepping stone. Rod. How about on the red side of the cage you bring me the rock star Keith Richardson! And now we have Keith Richardson walking to the cage. 13 and 6, Keith Richardson. Coming into the main event of the night, his hometown. Body got a modern warrior MMA in Rock Hill, South Carolina. Also cross training over there with Team Alpha Male in California, where he spent the last few weeks tightening up for this training camp. Keith has made it a habit in the last few fights to go out there, Team Alpha Male, to train with the cream of the crop, TJ Dillashaw. Uriah Faber and their whole crop of talent that they have over there. And all he seems to do is continue to make himself better and better and better. That young man continues to push himself to try to be the best fighter he can be. Sporting those white shorts. Born in New York, fighting out of Rock Hill, South Ladies Carolina. Ladies and it's gentlemen, this man. is the main event of the evening for Fight Lab 45. This fight is brought to you by the Olive Law Firm, Fuel in a Bottle, Satin Med Spa, FightDoctors.com, and Carolina MMA. Charlotte, North Carolina, are you ready? Then the time is now to meet the challenger in the blue corner. This young man comes to us from Kansas City, Missouri, fighting by way of Coconut Creek, Florida. He carries an impressive MMA record of 10 wins versus only three defeats, representing the world-famous American top team. Give it up! the beast, Andrew Whitney! And now, let's meet the young man to my right. This young man comes to us from Rock Hill, South Carolina. He has an impressive 
MMA record of 15 wins versus only six defeats. Representing Modern Warrior MMA, Charlotte, North Carolina, Rock Hill, South Carolina. Give it up for the Rock Star, Keith Richardson! It's obvious Keith Richardson has a huge following right here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Some people actually call him Mr. Fight Lab. <laughs> Keith has actually come up with a three-fight win streak. Maybe, maybe. He's keeping his fight or his streak going right now. now. This is one of the few times I've ever seen Keith being the smaller of the two opponents. Oh, I know. And he's actually come down in weight. Looked like he's switching stances, being very, very agile. Still pushing forward. And Andrew Whitley. It's kind of still, you know, getting his, getting his bearings. Nice high kick by Andrew. Return high kick by Keith. Both these two are swinging really, really big there. Even though Keith has his back against the cage, he's still being really, really dirty, really grimy. Still hanging on to the head. Reversed it, now has Andrew against the, Andrew Whitley against the cage. Looks for an elbow, missed on that one. Still fighting underneath, Look, got the body lock. Good job. Look to dump behind. And it's inside control, gonna take the back. Hopped inside the saddle. Did a great job of posturing back up. He was high just a few minutes, or just a few seconds ago. And Keith works his way back underneath. It looks like he has a Kimura on the far side. Good job by Whitley getting that reverse. Big swings with those right hands on the way up. And Keith has a very unpredictable style of striking. Oh, Moves right. out to the side and throws some weird angles. Couldn't agree more. Sometimes that style of fight leaves susceptible for some strikes. Mm. Keith would switch his stance one, uh, back again, unorthodox. Nice high low kicks. Keith doing a good job of moving in and moving out. Keith charging back in. And the back of Andrew's uh, leg is also reddened up already. Oh, absolutely. And again, same leg. Just chopping away at that tree, trying to take that explosive out of that, that front leg. Keith's doing a great job of doing that. Seems like Keith's really found his range. <clears throat> moving in, moving out, and being just outside of uh, Andrew's uh, strikes. Absolutely. Keith's move, movement has improved so much by being by out there by Team Alpha Male. Mm. I wonder if he picked up anything from TJ Dillashaw. Be nice to believe so. Nice mid-range kick, in and out. Good back and forth from these two. Andrew Whitley looks like he's trying to size him up before he throws something big. Nice strike right hand. Great, great job to get out of the way. Keith back on the attack, having Andrews back against the cage. Pressuring hard. Setting that short knee to the thighs. Nice exchange. Andrew Willie pushing back really hard. One thing I've noticed is that Andrew Willie's not really pressing, pressing too, too hard. 
He's picking the shots one and two, not throwing anything really big or throwing any big combinations out there just yet. Outside of maybe the first 30 seconds, everything's calmed down. It's almost like he's finding his he's finding his pace right now. And nice takedown by Keith. Straight in the mount position. And somehow Andrew has Whitley has reversed that. Now they're backstanding. Keith back against Cage. Nice short elbow to finish that round off by Keith Whitley. Something I find very surprising at the level of Andrew Whitley. He comes all the way up here, I believe, with his girlfriend, with, with uh, Tisha Torres <clears throat> and Tank Scoggins. With two teammates as his corner. That's one thing about having a huge team like ATT. Wherever you go, you'll, you'll know you have somebody back in your corner of high-level capability. See if Andrew turns it up this round. He's gonna have to. Nice kick again. Same kick, same leg that he's been doing the whole first round. Whitley backs up, lets Keith take advantage of that. Keith seems very comfortable in e either stance. Mm. And Keith goes for a Superman punch. And both disembark. Let's go. He's doing a really good job of mixing up his attacks from low and high and kicks. Absolutely staying as versatile as possible. Once again, pushing back in. Nice low kick. Good body oh, kick. Great body kick. He's definitely has to do a better job of keeping his hands up. He's got clipped twice. Mm -hmm. Don't know how bad he's hurt, but you can tell it's something that he, they are distinguished. Well, both times it's happened coming out. Once again, nice jump towards the back. Jumps in the saddle. Looking to figure for the body, and he does. He might be here they for some time, and he has it in naked. He has it in deep, and attack. Excellent job for Keith Richardson. Spectacular finish. Another great job to finish up. Nice back and forth battle. Looked really, really good for Keith Richardson. Just as soon as you say something about him maybe being hurt, he turns back around, gets a dunk, and finishes off with a rear naked. Great execution.
Another exciting night of fights here at Fight Lab. And what a way to cap it off with a finish from Keith Richardson. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout comes to an end, two minutes and five seconds into the second round. Your winner out of the red corner by Rear Naked Choke, the rock star, Keith Richardson! guys another great night of fights here at fight lab 45 on the six-year anniversary i'm joe pacheco here with jeremiah we're over and out